Welcome to the video tutorial of Smart Yard Parking Test. This video will help you to successfully pass the RTA Smart Yard Parking Test by providing you the step-by-step -step guide on five types of parking maneuvers and useful passing tips. Enhance the parking test passing rate and prevent accidents to be a safe driver. The Smart Yard consists of five parking maneuvers to ensure you are fully trained with parking skills. Emergency brake test, angle parking test, garage parking test, parallel parking test, slope test. Each type of parking maneuver is evaluated by sensors and cameras. The vehicles are monitored by RTA examiners. You have only 20 minutes to complete the maneuvers. Drive at the speed of 20 km per hour to avoid disqualification or drive between 1000 rpm to 2000 rpm. Always check the other passing vehicles to avoid collision. The marker plates will guide you to the next test coming your way. Disqualifications from the parking test. 1. Always wear the seatbelt before starting the test. 2. Do not open the door during the test. 3. Do not exceed 20 minutes to complete the smart yard parking test. 4. Do not exceed the speed of 35 km per hour. Manual transmission. 5. Do not accelerate more than 3,000 RPM. 6. Avoid stalling the engine more than three times. Immediate fail. You will fail immediately for first pressing the clutch pedal and then the brake pedal. Do not press both the clutch and the brake pedal together. Do not touch the yellow line while entering a parking bay. Do not park outside the parking bay. Do not exceed the time limit of each parking maneuver. Do not let the vehicle roll back 30 centimeters. Do not touch the white line or yellow line in the slope test. Demerit points. One, failed to check left or right mirror. Two, failed to check rear windscreen. Three, failed to check right shoulder while entering the angle parking. Four, failed to check the left shoulder while vehicle swings outwards into the bay. Five, each additional reverse. Six, failed to check left shoulder before leaving the bay. Seven, dry steering. Eight, failed to put the gear into P after parking inside the bay, automatic. Nine, failed to release the handbrake while vehicle is moving. 10. Roll back more than 15 centimeters and less than 30 centimeters. Slope test. 11. Obtaining six demerit points can lead a candidate to failing that particular maneuver. 12. Additional reverse movement is applicable in parking, garage, and angle parking test. Candidates coming for retests are given five minutes plus the maneuver's time. For example, at garage parking, time allowed is three minutes for the maneuver plus five minutes for the retest equals eight minutes. Exceeding this time will be an immediate fail. Always remember to check DSSSM doors, seat, steering wheel, seat belt, mirrors. Doors. Close the door properly to avoid disqualification during the examination. Seat. Adjust the seat to your comfortable position. Steering wheel. Adjust the steering wheel to your comfortable height. Hold the steering wheel firmly to detect your fingerprints. Seat belt. Buckle up the seat belt to avoid disqualification from the test. Mirrors. Adjust the mirrors to clearly see the rear and side views. Show thumbs up in the right camera when you are ready. Examination will begin. Start the parking test with reverse gear. Prepare, observe and check all sides before you begin the parking maneuvers. Release the handbrake. Reverse slowly while checking behind. Proceed to your first parking test. RTA Parking Test 1 Emergency Brake Test. Observe before accelerating. Apply hard brake first and then clutch for manual transmission. Apply hard brake for automatic transmission. Maintain the speed of 20 km to 25 km per hour before crossing the white line. Hold the steering wheel firmly with both hands. As soon as you hear the beep sound, immediately apply hard brake. Do not exceed the speed over 20 km per hour while exiting the line. Proceed to the next test while checking the other vehicles. 
Emergency brake test tip one. For manual transmission, you will immediately fail for first pressing the clutch pedal and then the brake pedal. Emergency brake test tip two. Do not press both the clutch and brake pedal together. Emergency brake test tip three. Do not exceed the speed of 35 km per hour, otherwise disqualification will be applied. Emergency brake test tip four. Do not immediately increase the speed after stopping the vehicle. You will be immediately disqualified for exceeding the speed and the vehicle will crash. How to restart the engine on automatic transmission vehicle. Step one, shift to neutral gear mode. Step two, switch on the engine. Step three, shift to drive gear or first gear to move the vehicle. RTA parking test two, angle parking test. This is the angle parking test. Two minutes to complete the maneuver. Position the vehicle towards the left line. The timer will start when you switch on the right indicator. Prepare, observe, and move towards the angle parking bay. Check the sighting point. Do a quick right side head check to see the blind spots before turning the vehicle. Turn the steering wheel 360 degrees towards the right side. Slowly move towards the parking bay without touching the lines. Turn the steering wheel to the normal position when the vehicle matches the line. See the left side door handle matches with behind white line. Then stop the vehicle, pull the handbrake. Then shift the gear to neutral for manual and parking for automatic transmission. This will end the parking test three angle parking test. Exit the parking bay by reversing slowly. Switch on the right indicator before moving the vehicle. Observe your left and right side and rear view. Check your right shoulder and turn to look behind. Slowly release the handbrake when you are ready. Move slowly while observing other vehicles for possible hazards. Keep checking behind while exiting the parking bay. When you match the yellow line to the left side mirror, Immediately turn right and turn the steering wheel 360 degrees while reversing. Keep in mind that the slope area is behind your vehicle. Proceed to your next parking test. Angle parking test additional reverse movement tips. If the student misses the first sighting point and realizes that he is going to touch the line, he is allowed the additional reverse by following the steps below. Step 1. Stop the vehicle before touching the yellow line. Step two, engage reverse gear. Observe all around you, especially behind. Avoid dry steering. Step three, reverse slowly and turn the steering wheel towards the left to straighten the vehicle. Step four, engage the first gear in manual and D for automatic transmission and move slowly towards the angle bay. Step five, stop the vehicle when the left side door handle matches behind the white line. Pull the handbrake and shift the gear into P for automatic and neutral for manual vehicle. RTA parking test three, garage parking test. three minutes to complete the maneuver. Position the vehicle towards the left line. The timer will start when you engage the reverse gear. Switch on the right indicator. Prepare, observe and move towards the garage parking bay. Make sure to check the traffic all around you before reversing. Reverse slowly while checking behind. Check the sighting point before turning the vehicle. Check the left shoulder. Turn the steering wheel 360 degrees towards the right. Move slowly while entering the garage parking bay. Check the sighting point.
Turn the steering wheel 360 degrees towards the left. Check the rear line once it matches the door handle. Stop the vehicle. Pull the handbrake. Then shift the gear to neutral for manual or parking for automatic transmission. This will end the parking test for garage parking test. Exit the parking bay by driving ahead. Switch on the right indicator before moving the vehicle. Prepare, observe and move while exiting the garage parking bay. Release the handbrake. Drive slowly. When the yellow line matches your shoulder, turn the steering wheel 360 degrees towards the right. Proceed to your next parking test. RTA Parking Test 4 Parallel Parking Test. This is the parallel parking test. Five minutes to complete the maneuver. Drive towards the right lane at the right position. Start the parking test with reverse gear. Switch on the right indicator. Prepare, observe and check all sides before you begin the parking test. Slowly reverse while checking the right side mirror. When the yellow line disappears on the right side mirror, check the left shoulder for any hazard. Turn the steering wheel 360 degrees towards the right side. Check the line once it matches the front door handle. Turn the steering wheel towards the left side. Check the rear yellow line once it matches the front right side door handle. Stop the vehicle. Pull the handbrake. Then shift the gear to neutral for manual and parking for automatic transmission. This will end the parking test 5 parallel parking test. Switch on the left indicator to exit the parking bay. Check the left shoulder for any possible hazards. Release the handbrake and exit the parking bay by driving slowly. Proceed to your next parking test. RTA Parking Test 5 Slope Test You have 90 seconds to complete the slope test. Stop the vehicle between the yellow and white line. and pull the handbrake immediately. For manual transmission, ensure to balance the clutch and accelerator. Maintain the speed up to 1500 RPM. Pull down the handbrake while moving uphill. Automatic transmission, accelerate up to 1500 RPM. Pull down the handbrake while moving uphill. Control the speed when driving downhill while processing for the next maneuver. Slope test tip one. Do not accelerate more than 3,000 RPM, as the increased speed will crash the brake pedal and the vehicle will stop and start rolling backwards. In this situation, immediately pull the handbrake to stop the vehicle. Slope test tip two. Control the speed when driving downhill. Increasing the speed above 3,000 RPM will immediately stop the vehicle and disqualification will apply. How to restart the engine on automatic transmission vehicle. Step one, shift to neutral gear mode. Step two, switch on the engine. Step three, shift to drive gear or first gear to move the vehicle. Slope test tip three, balance the accelerator and clutch to avoid engine stall. Slope test tip four, do not touch the white line or yellow line. Slope test tip five, do not roll back 30 centimeters or more. Carefully park the vehicle to complete RTA Smart Yard Parking Test. The test has finished. Step 1. Apply the handbrake. Step 2. Shift the gear to neutral for manual and parking for automatic transmission. Step 3. Remove the seatbelt. Step 4. Open the door. Collect the test result inside the waiting area.